Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. So I am so excited to have you here because Kendrick and I are about to do what we do in the kitchen. My husband never really cooked before we got married so he has learned quite a bit about cooking. And so tonight we are gonna be preparing our favorite family meal that just gives you such good feelings on the inside. And we'll be making shrimp Alfredo and we will be making the Alfredo sauce from scratch. And we're gonna be doing it together. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you are looking for something quick and easy and absolutely delicious to make for your family, I would suggest you keep watching. So now I'm gonna add the fettuccine pasta to my water. And the water looks this color because I add chicken bouillon to my water with my pastas because it gives it such a good flavor. Like if you haven't tried it, try it. So I got two of those. And let me show you guys what I'm talking about when I say the chicken bouillon, hang on. This is the chicken bouillon and it's kind of like a powder. I'm gonna open it for you guys so you can see. See, it's kind of like a powder and it transforms your food. If you are not cooking, using that, to cook your meals, let me tell you, you're missing out. You are missing out. Now, don't use too much because it can be quite salty if you overkill it, so don't overkill it, okay? I'm gonna take this bacon and I am going to cut it in slices because this is also gonna go into the recipe. So good, y'all. So Kendrick is over here making biscuits. Y'all know the Red Lobster Cheddar Bay biscuits. If you don't know, this is what it looks like. So he's over here making the biscuits. Mm, mm, mm. So he's about to just dab them on the parchment paper. And they don't have to be cute, they can have their own little personality. So right here what I have is, this is shredded Parmesan cheese that I shredded, I grated myself. Um, these are some cherry tomatoes, mushrooms, and this is the bacon that I cut up. And here are the shrimp. Kendrick's peeled them and they've been washed. So yeah, I'm gonna be making the Alfredo sauce, sauce from scratch. So I got, this is the only thing they had at the store. I usually use the regular um, block of cream cheese, but Kendrick said they didn't have it at the store, so he wound up getting this, which it's all good. I got some heavy whipping cream, and I even have some, um, the package of Parmesan cheese, just in case I don't have enough of the real deal. So yeah, let's go ahead and get this cooking. Kendrick over here getting the bacon all fried up. All right, so Kendrick's gonna scoop out the bacon. Now that's a lot of oil left in that pot, so he's gonna pour off some of that oil because we don't need all that oil for the shrimp. These are gonna take probably another one to two minutes to cook and these are done, y'all. Look how beautiful they are. So at this point, he's gonna go ahead and just add the mushroom and just let those cook for the remaining one to two minutes. <laughs> All right, so now he's gonna go ahead and put the garlic in the pot where the butter is. Now he's adding in the heavy whipping cream. Where are my Italian folks at? So right here, we're gonna add in two egg yolks to this roux, and this is gonna help like thicken it up and give it that nice consistency. So while Kendrick serves, I'm gonna just go ahead and just add it in. So now he's gonna add in that cream cheese. But this is so good, this is so easy, y'all. Anybody can make your own Alfredo sauce and you can put whatever you want in it and make it your own. You know, that store-bought stuff is not what's up. I'm here to tell you. It's easy, it's convenient, but it doesn't taste nearly as good, y'all. All right, so we seasoned the sauce with black pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, and a little bit of my favorite, y'all. Slap your mama, I know y'all seen this. So I add a little bit of that, give it a little kick, you know? Oh, and we also put some ranch seasoning in there just to give it a little bit of a purpose, you know what I mean? 
So now he's gonna go ahead and add in the cheese. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all look at the consistency of that. Look at this. Look at that y'all, isn't that beautiful? It's a little on the thick side, um, but that's okay. That's okay. Y'all look at the consistency. See how good that looks? That's what you want. You want to be able to almost fold it. All right, so we went ahead and added the pasta and we're gonna mix it up. So I have more pasta, I just didn't put it all in. I just wanted to eyeball how much sauce I have. And see, as you can see, it's still like a lot of sauce. So I'm gonna go ahead and add the rest of the pasta. So now we're gonna go ahead and add those cherry tomatoes. And I add these last because I don't want my tomatoes being too cooked. I like fresh tomatoes in my pasta. We're gonna go ahead and add the meat. Y'all remember those shrimp and that bacon? Oh my goodness gracious. This just changes the whole dynamic of the meal. When you add in those proteins, mm, mm, mm. top it off. Oh, look at that, y'all. Oh my God, baby, don't that look good? Delicious. <laughs> Can't wait. <laughs> ah! Y'all, we call dibs on food in this house. Like when it's the last bit, we like call, if you don't call dibs on it, you have no rights to it. Somebody else got it. Unless you don't eat it that day. Then oh, that yeah. next day is, is back on the market. Yeah. <laughs> if you don't eat it that day, before the next day, or by the next day, nah, G. We're going to go ahead and top it off with some greenery. So, y'all, I got a story to tell y'all. So, I sent ain't, her. Ain't no story. Ain't no story here. They, it's okay. We got to be transparent with the folks. You know, mm -hmm. they got to know we human, just like them, right? Well, you know, but yeah. they know. <laughs> <laughs> he don't want me to tell him, so I want to tell y'all, so I won't tell y'all. No, nah, it's all, it's all good. It do what you got to do. I'm going to keep it to myself. Y'all, she sent me this, get some paisley. Dry. Some, some what? Paisley. <laughs> what, what is it? Parsley? Parsley. Oh, I'm sorry. Parsley. Dried parsley, and I got dried basil. It's all good. So, they, they about the same thing anyway. Basil got a little bit more flavor. Daddy! Daddy! So I did I did daddy, justice to the meal there. You are being so Yes, good. honey, sweetheart. Yes. Alright, y'all. There we go. Y'all, so the biscuits are done. And Kendrick's gonna go ahead and paint them with that butter sauce. These biscuits are so good. Y'all should definitely try them. I think you got them. Where you got them from? Walmart? Kendra got these from Publix, but you can also get them from Walmart. So while mommy and daddy in here cooking, Avi is cleaning. What you doing, mommy? What you doing? Oh yeah? Are you mopping or are you using yourself as the mop? <laughs> you're supposed to mop the floor. There's the mop, y'all. No. No? So you're not gonna mop? No? Okay. Mom, what did you do to this food? What do you mean? It's making my mouth water. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Yeah, this is one of our favorite meals in this house, let me tell you. You really and she cook barely it. cook it. It's my, it's my favorite. My favorite. Y'all like can y'all can tell when a man cooks. Look, look at the stove, y'all. <laughs> and guess who gotta clean it? <laughs> me. All right, y'all, we about to eat. So we love you guys. We will talk to y'all later. Bye. I know you guys saw how delicious that shrimp Alfredo looked. I know it. I know your mouths were watering. I just, I know it. And the bacon, ooh. Mm. So good, y'all. You better try it. Let me tell you, you try it, you will not regret it. And whoever eats it will think that you are the real deal, even if you are not the real deal. You hear me? <laughs> 
But I just want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. I truly appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video just as much as we enjoyed making the video for you. We will see you guys tomorrow. Take care guys. Bye.